Hello, and welcome to the Fall Product Program Weekly Updates. First off, a big thank you to the GPS team for hosting virtual rallies to kick off the program. The Girl Scout cadets, seniors, and ambassadors who hosted the virtual rallies did an awesome job, and we had lots of girls sign up and participate. FYI, rally patches will be distributed to service units along with girl rewards. And we are off to a great start. Lots of girls have created their avatars, launched their storefronts, and sent emails or shared the order card with friends and family. If you haven't started yet, there's still plenty of time for Girl Scouts and troops to participate. Families, wondering what steps to take to help your Girl Scout get started in the fall product program? Check out the article on our blog that posted this week that highlights the steps to take. The article includes links to the family guides, and also a link to a short demo video of the M2OS system posted to Facebook and YouTube. It'll show you everything you need to know to help your Girl Scout get started. Links to that article, the guides, and the video are in the description box for this video as well. Also note, your Troop Fall Product Manager is your go-to person if you have questions or you need support. For Troop Fall Product Managers who are just getting started, know that the TFPM training is available in GS Learn and it's posted to the GSEO Facebook page and YouTube channel. For an overview of the program and to learn how to use the M2 operating system, you can find the troop guides and all other resources on the Fall Product Program page of our website. I included links to the TFPM guides in the description box for this video too. If you have questions or you need some additional guidance, your Service Unit Fall Product Manager is your go-to person. And for Service Unit Fall Product Managers, if you need assistance, reach out to your Product Program Specialist on staff for support. Their contact information is in the SUFPM guide. We have two contests going during the program and I wanted to share a couple of reminders about them. First, the Magazine Contest. The first 50 girls who sell 15 or more magazine subscriptions and complete the Magazine Contest form will receive a cool camp hammock. The first 50 girls will be based on the date that the contest form is submitted and the verified number of magazine subscriptions sold. The contest form is open. Girls should complete the form as soon as they sell 15 magazine subscriptions. Where's the link to the form? It's in the description box for this video, of course, and you'll find it in the contest article that's on our GSCO blog. The second contest is a drawing for the giant sloth. That form is also open and it closes on 12-11. It's best for girls to complete that contest form at the end of the program because there's three different ways to earn entries into the drawing. Girls who renew their membership by September 30th, 2020 and who participate in the fall product program will get one drawing entry. Girls who sell 15 or more magazine subscriptions get two drawing entries. And girls who reach the level of $650 or more in combined sales, online and or in person, Will get three drawing entries, with the possibility of getting up to six total entries to the drawing. Girls must complete the Sloth Contest form, but they only need to do it once. On the form, they can select which criteria they met. So keep that December 11th date in mind, and girls be sure to fill out the form. If you like this video or other weekly reminders, please share them. Thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great weekend.